Hey guys, how you doing today? So I've got the Xtool D5S, and I've had people ask me if this scan tool uh, is able to uh, retract the uh, electronic parking brakes so that you can put rear pads on cars. And I've got it connected up to our 2015 Lexus uh, NX200T, and we'll just go through the steps to do that. And I also uh, I'll also do an ABS actuation to show you that it'll actuate the ABS system so that you can bleed the uh, bleed the brakes also. So we're going to go right here to EPB, that's electronic parking brake, and we'll cruise down here to Lexus. Says North America. We'll do automatic detection. Does not have radar crews, and we're going to go. Uh, we're going to look at actuation test first. Okay, so I've got the door open. We're going to go ahead, and we're going to go to. Uh, we'll do the first one. I'm not sure which one of these it's going to be to retract the uh, parking brake. But we're going to hit that first one. Uh, this test will activate parking brake release. Uh, three on off, execute ignition on, and the vehicle stopped. Okay, and I'm gonna hit on. Hopefully, you're hearing that. And there they are, they're retracted. And just to make sure that you can hear them go back the other way. So right now they're retracted to where you could put brake pads on your vehicle. I'm going to put the camera out here. I'm going to hit uh, the off button and we're going to reset them. And there you go. So, as you can see, if you had to put brakes on this car, rear, rear pads, uh, you would have been able to do it. Now, let me get you down here. So now, what's under special functions? Okay, check mode. Okay. Um, let's go over here to, uh, ABS bleeding, and I'm, I want to see if it will, uh, kick the pump on, just so you'll see. And then we're going to go over to our Jeep, and we're going to see if the ABS pump will, uh, if this scan tool will be able to kick the ABS pump on, on our, uh, 2007 Jeep. Auto detection. And this is just to show you that this scan tool is a capable scan tool. I've had people, you know, uh, claim that uh, they're not sure if it would actually, uh, if these functions would actually work. And I've only had one time that my Xtool D8 failed to kick on a uh, air suspension uh, pump on a, I think it was a 2012 Armada. I want to open the door just to make sure that if the pump kicks on, we can hear it. Okay, I hear the pump. I don't know if you just heard that. And it's and it walks you through it. You can see the uh, the instructions there telling you what you need to do. I want to hit continue. Hold you out of the uh, car here. Hopefully, you heard that pump. That, that's a very quiet pump, but the pump is turning on. 
And it's got nice instructions that walk you straight through the procedure. You can feel the brake pedal moving up and down while I'm going through this. And I'm not actually doing a bleed, but once you go around the car and you follow the instructions, uh, the system would be bled out. And as you can see now, it says air bleeding is complete. So again, this is a 2015 Lexus NX200T. The X-Tool not only retracted the parking brake, but it also uh, just uh, did a uh, ABS bleed. Or function. So let's go over to the 2007 Jeep and we'll make sure that the ABS pump will kick on on it and then uh, we'll call this video done. This is just a demonstration showing that the little $150 X-Tool D5S uh, is a very capable tool. Okay guys we're going to have a little bit of a glare on this but we'll do our best. So this is a 2007 Jeep and all I want to do is just kick the ABS pump on to show you that the uh, ABS pump, or to show you that this scan tool will control a Jeep Wrangler also. So we'll click Jeep. We'll just do auto detection. And it's already found the Jeep Wrangler. ABS brakes. Uh, bleed brakes. I'm going to open the door. Hopefully so you can hear the pump. Click OK. Press the brake pedal. Okay, pedal just went to the floor. Hopefully, you just hopefully you're hearing the pump. Whenever that pump kicks on, the brake pedal comes back up. Hopefully, you can hear that. Now it's telling you to go to the right front. And there you go. So, as you can see, uh, the little D5S seems to work fine. So, if you're thinking about getting a little scan tool so that you can change brake pads on your car that has electronic parking brake or bleed the brake uh, system uh, because you had it opened up, uh, the scan tool will probably probably do the job for you. Anyway, we're done. You guys take care. We'll see you in the next one.